What's up guys, Apathetic here, and today we're gonna to be talking about Claws of the Wolf, the new Iron Banner Pulse Rifle. So I'm gonna go over the God roll I have and the other rolls that you're gonna to wanna to look for and just overall how this thing performs in the Crucible because after all, even if you have a God roll gun in terms of perks, the gun itself isn't really performing, then it's just gonna be a waste. So we're gonna go and jump into what my role is. So my role guys, brace yourselves. So I'm running small bore for my barrel, appended mag, which increases the overall magazine size, which is a great perk, especially for a pulse rifle that fires as fast as this one. Then I have outlaw, which increases my reload speed. And the big one here is full auto. Now I'm not messing guys. This weapon reminds me of the clever dragon from D1. This thing fires so damn fast and with full auto, it kind of feels like an auto rifle sometimes. And you'll see in some of these clips, I use it like auto and occasionally I'll fire from the hip and it actually works. I'm able to fire a pulse rifle from my hip like an auto. What? Now this pulse also has a very sticky aim, which makes it very easy to track your targets and land those headshots in rapid succession. And if you were to combine this thing with a counterbalance or target acquisition mod, whoo, my God, this thing, this thing would be disgusting. Don't get me wrong, guys. This gun is already pretty dirty. If you can't see from these clips how fast I'm melting people, but with those mods, it would just it just be wrong. Now, what perks should I get on this gun? I'm glad you asked. So, if I had one bad thing to say about this weapon, it would probably be the reload speed. And combine that with how fast this bad boy fires, you could easily find yourself reloading way too much, and we want to try to uh, negate that as much as possible. So. With that in mind, you're gonna want perks that help overcome that. So in the first column, you're gonna want either Appended Mag, Flared Magwell, or Ally Magazine. All perks that are either gonna increase the magazine size or reload speed. That's what you want. Either a large magazine so you don't run out of bullets as quickly, or a quick reload speed. So if you are running out of bullets quickly, which you will with this gun, you're gonna be able to compensate for that. Uh, in the second column, of course Outlaw is always amazing, but Outside of Outlaw, another great perk is Slide Shot. Now, I've really fallen in love with this perk. I had all my bygones, and it's just super, super clutch. And basically, what it allows you to do is keep your magazine relatively full at all times uh, and keep you from reloading as much. Uh, because as you're sliding around, it's automatically reloading uh, partially a partial part of your magazine. And then also gives you a small boost to range and stability. And that never hurts, guys. Now, what else could you possibly want in that last column besides full auto? Guys, honestly, full auto is going to be pretty tough to beat, especially with the archetype of this pulse rifle, uh, how fast it shoots. Just full auto is the perfect, perfect perk for this uh, type of pulse. But for me, if there was another perk I had to choose, the only other one I would be happy with is Rampage. And I like Rampage because it give you that nice boost in damage. So that way you're making the most of the magazine before it runs out. So you're able to string a lot of kills together without having to back off, reload. And that allows that, that can allow the enemy to actually close the gap on you. Uh, some of you may be thinking about Kill Clip, uh, but Kill Clip doesn't really work with this because you don't want to reload. You want to try to avoid reloading as much as possible here. And Kill Clip, obviously, in order to be effective, requires you to reload and so that's just not going to work with this kind of weapon guys so with that guys you now know what rolls to look out for as you grind iron banner and don't hesitate to comment down below what god rolls you guys are receiving and i don't know if you guys have seen the bounties but man they are long but it did allow me to get this bad boy and start my iron banner off with a bang keep an eye out for more iron banner weapon reviews in the future and if you enjoyed the video don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more destiny 2 content i'd really appreciate it, it helps me out guys and i will catch you in the next one